I don't know how long I gonna wait And I don't know how long we gonna wait I'm here already 15 minutes Today is 21st of April and I'm in Batangkali There's a heavy rain in this morning and as I say, heavy rain equals to traffic jam This theory is not just applied in Kuala Lumpur It applied in Batangkali as well I'm going for the closing ceremony for the mud ball making and today's today is the day that they're gonna throw all the mud ball into the river with this weather I I don't think I can fly my drone <sighs> yeah every day rain 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 every day rain and touch me now I'm just flying by Rain Yeah, uh, I'm having my breakfast right now and we're gonna be fast. So we're gonna start soon. I think it's gonna start because the studio is working today already. So I need to be fast. The ceremony gonna start anytime from now. Uh, like Sick Paolo. Oh fire or sick I'm now in the middle of the So uh, this is how it looks like. Yeah, it's hard like rock. It's very hard. And I'm gonna try one. <laughs> Estimated about ten thousands in total. One eternity later. Okay. There's still a lot left, so I asked from them. 
I would have trolled my boy as well. I'm done. By the way, this is Gibson. <laughs> Actually, it's quite nice to play with it. I'm gonna throw another one. Tiring, but uh, yeah, it's fine. Hello, Jun. Hi. Hello. <laughs> She's the uh, representative. This Jun Liu. There's still a lot, there's still a lot left here. So, yeah, I'm going to throw myself. See me now, miles above you. Don't care what they're saying below, cause I'm miles above, I'm miles above you. That's all for the event and the whole event just lasts about 30 to 45 minutes uh, for the kids to throw all this mud ball into the river. And it is short but the kids is actually having fun throwing all this mud ball and they're happy. They will realize that this all environment care activity is actually fun, it's just actually happy. So they will do it in the future. They will just do it consistently in the future. And this is for me more important than uh, the whole result itself in this event. You cannot teach a kids how to take care of the river in one day or maybe in one activity, in one program. But what you can do is to aware them what is happening. And for me, environment care is uh, categorized to two, two types. And one is be active. Uh, the activity like this, uh, you teach the kids how to make the mud ball. Uh, you making the mud ball, you throw all this mud ball into the river in order to make the river cleaner. This is active, and in the other way, passive. It's not necessary for you to do everything that here. Yeah, it's not necessary for you to make the mud ball. It's not necessary for you to throw all this mud ball into the river. For me, passive can be environment care as well, as long as you don't throw rubbish into the river and this is very important as well because uh, when there's less people doing bad thing to the environment do you hear that okay uh, back to the topic eventually the kids that involved in this project actually I'm not expecting them to be active in the environment care activity in the future but as long as they don't make it worse for those of you who are watching, uh, if you have any comment about the environment care activity, you can leave me a comment and don't forget to click like and subscribe to my channel. See you tomorrow. No one can touch me now. I'm just flying by. Yeah, I'm just flying by.
I'm not sure you can see it or not. Uh, there's a rainbow up here. Yeah, 